Xantra. Call me a couple hours ago because I didn't want to hear you yell. Yes, jump in. No, I just want to say something. Just one quick comment. Every relationship should begin with some level of respect. Absolutely. If she's going to call you the N-word, she has no respect for you or your family. Or your family. So you need to check yourself. And you, you need to, you need to think about the respect that you're giving your Yeah, I saw them. You saw They're okay. Yo, I give you props for being up here, you know what I'm saying? It takes a lot of heart and stuff. You know what I'm saying? We got to take them back. Yeah, do you think during the course of this hour you could show him some of your moves, maybe teach him some stuff? We could. We're going to send him out here. He's going to be looking like flavor when we come out here. We can give him another strip chance later on, right? All right. Stefan, you just need a little work. You need a little work. Make sure you got a dollar ready. All right. Charles is going to show you how it's done. I can't wait to see Stefan when he's learned something besides that one move. Up next, a woman who says her man's 80-pound weight gain is crushing their sex life. Will he be crushed when he learns her ultimatum to lose the weight or lose her? Find out after this. How much weight has he put on? He's put on at least 80 pounds. Ricky, I like to eat. Sex is difficult with him. I can crush his face. And he thinks he's a beef man. I'm Mike Straub looking elsewhere. Maybe the door's there. Let's see what he has learned. Stefan? Do they include playing video games? Or making video games? Or both? Stop dreaming. Pick up the phone. Call the International Academy of Design Toronto and start a career doing what you love in the new game design program. Call 1-866-425-5449. That's 1-866-425-5449 now. It's a cheater's challenge. Three months ago, I started suspecting that he was cheating. I'm here today to prove that I wasn't even cheating. Are you willing to do anything? Yeah. A cheater can cheat, but what will they have to eat? Spin that wheel. Whatever you land on, you're going to eat as much of it as you can. We're going to have a little tongue. Go. Oh, yeah. Has Ernest proven his love to you, or do you still need the results of his lie detector test? I still need the results. What's a cheater to do? Next, Ricky. The G-string. She wear the G-string, Ricky? You can't even see it anymore. She give two, she give laugh dances two at a time, Ricky, but two at a time. That's why she makes so much money, because she could do two at a time. I'm not trying to be skinny. I wasn't made to be skinny. I have a lot of women. I come from a long line of big women. You know your mama big. We all big. <laughs> Talk about my mama. My show say that if their men don't start losing some weight, they are going to lose them. Our next guest, Marianne, says her husband, Steve, stopped caring about how he looked when he turned the big 4-0. She says if he doesn't stop packing on the pounds, she may start looking elsewhere for romance. Really? Is it that serious? Yeah, it's that bad. It's like food is his life. He's like constantly non-stop eating. One day I can tell you what it, it consists of. Tell us. I cook dinner. It's spaghetti. Two plates of spaghetti. I had to run an errand. As we're walking out the door, he's eating Pop-Tarts. We run the errand. We had to stop, the ga uh, stop to put air in the tire. We got to stop at the gas station. Two candy bars. I'm like, come on now. We get home, get ready for bed. And he's telling me, oh, now I got to put gas in the truck. I'm like, what do you mean you got to put gas in the truck? I was like, whatever. Comes back, he's got McDonald's. <laughs> he's That's a growing boy. Huh? How much weight has he put on? He's put on at least 80 pounds. 80 pounds. Too much for you. You're just not attracted to him anymore? So, huh? 
You're not attracted to him anymore. Oh, no, no. Sex is difficult with him. I, he crushes me. <laughs> hey, tell us much. about it. It's, it's, it's too much. Yeah, I, get off me. I can't hold the weight, you know? And he thinks he's a bait magnet. We turned around and we had a family fun night with the kids' school. And at family fun night is they had a bingo party. We packed the cafeteria with the kids' parents, the kids, the whole nine yards, everything was sitting in the back row, right in the corner, we're right there. At the end of the night, they had a DJ. He gets up and starts dancing and shaking his belly. I was mortified. Yeah, he was doing a mean cabbage patch. Mortified. Mean cabbage patch, you know? And that's not the first time he's embarrassed you. I no, know you tried to do a family portrait. Family portrait, everybody got decked out. I mean, dressed to the nines. I said, Stephen, you gotta put a suit on. I mean, come on, you gotta look, you know? He couldn't even fit in his suit, couldn't button the shirt. The jacket wouldn't fit. And then he's going to tell me that he's going to throw on a T-shirt. But come on, you married acceptable. him for better, for, for worse, worse, right? You love him unconditionally? Unconditionally. But he thinks now he has the nerve to turn around and say to me, if I get fat, I'm going to leave you. You're fat. So are you saying if he doesn't lose weight, you're going to lose him? I, I might start looking elsewhere. Uh-oh. Yeah. That doesn't sound like unconditional love to me. Let's hear what your husband has to say. Come on out, Steve. Live 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 How you doing? How you doing? Uh. Hey, Steve. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Nice to see you. Welcome oh. to the corporation. Yeah, I mean... You, you got it all in one place. You got some skinny little legs down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, Ricky, you know, that's what happens with age. You know, gravity is taking its toll. I'm sagging in places that I never knew existed. But you feel good about yourself. Well, yeah, I, I've done everything I've wanted to do in life. Yeah, you but know, and you're I'm... embarrassing the kids. How is he embarrassing them? Like, he went to pick up my daughter from school, and her, her friends turned around and said they were afraid of They were scared of him. Why, was they, it Because he was scary looking. <laughs> and that's because of his weight. Yeah, they, he scares people. He doesn't look so big to me. Yeah. He's big. Well, you know what it is? My wife is used to seeing Steve at 170 pounds and, you know, working two jobs, doing, you know, 14, 15 hours yeah, a day. Yeah, these are the pictures that, uh, the way you used to look. Yeah, okay? yeah. You know, and, 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 you know, in the last couple of years, yeah, all right, I, I've gained some weight, but you know what? Some weight? Yeah, yeah, I was a player. I was out there yeah, doing right, my thing. Yeah, <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah, it's like, oh, oh, yeah, so, yeah. Oh, I'm ready to leave him. Yo, baby, the door's there. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Do you feel like you're not supported by your wife? I'm sorry, was that Ricky? Do you feel like she doesn't support you? No, she... We, I can't support him. <laughs> no, we, we, we do have a good relationship uh, overall. Uh, you know, five kids in 22 years. Yeah. And a lot just, of food. Huh? Lots Talk of food. about your food. Lots of food. food. Ricky, I like to eat. You know, I don't I, blame you. I do, oh, too. Man, you, you know, no, but you know what? <laughs> we had role reversal here. I went food shopping. I bought a box of Captain Crunch. My daughter comes home and she says, Mommy, where's the Captain Crunch? She says, all I had was one bowl. Oh, well, the Captain Crunch. He happening. ate the rest of the Captain Crunch. <laughs> There's your Captain Crunch. Yeah, I, 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 I get on binges. I, I don't eat that often. I really don't. Uh, but I do go on a binge. And I will sit there Sunday afternoon. She works Sundays, OK? I'll sit there with the kids. I'll do the pancakes and the bacon. Yeah, and, and the sausage. Yeah, well, okay. Uh, <laughs> and juice. And yeah. bagels. And then, McDonald's then, you know, and chocolate bars and... <coughs> yeah, you know, but it, Ricky, I'm having fun in life at this age. You know what I'm saying? I am really happy with myself, my family Isn't situation. Isn't that what it's about, Marianne? He's happy. He's Make enjoying happy. life. Make me happy. I want to be proud of him. I, I want to say my man not proud of him. She's a Piers Brosnan fan. She wants me to look like Piers Brosnan. And, you know, I, well, I you mean, know what? We, we obviously, unfortunately, we can't get you to lose 80 pounds <laughs> in the course of an hour, but we can give you a mini makeover. How'd you like that? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> Maybe get, give you a haircut, what, shave what, the beard, what, give you some nice clothes. Good. This is my chilling out clothes. We're going to hook you up, honey. We're going to hook you up. All right, we'll make you feel even better about yourself. And Marianne, enough with the ultimatums. <laughs> Love him for who he is. All right, we're going to send you off. Look, here comes our Vanna. Whoa, 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 whoa. There you go. We'll see you later, Steve. Bye-bye. <laughs> Coming up, our Battle of the Bulge finds two drag queens waging a battle royale over weight. Queen number one says her friend's so fat she fell through a runway during a performance, but queen number two says that's a big fat lie. We'll get the skinny on their story right after this.
she's about 400 plus pounds. You know what? Bigger is better. If you can't hide it, decorate it. Pull it in. Pat it up. She needs to get a life. Did you, in fact, sink the runway? Please, do us the honor of strutting your stuff on the runway. Oh. Steve, come on down. Somebody's going to get lucky tonight. <laughs> Do you fear for the safety of a loved one who is obsessed with meeting men over the internet? If you want to stop them from internet dating and having cyber sex, you can be a guest. Call 1-800-GO-RICKY or log on to www.ricky.com. Clamato Caesar. Not recommended for everyone. Thank you for calling Sleep Country. This is Christine. You need to cancel the Serta sale. <laughs> we can't do that. Our customers love our big Serta sale. Can't they count sheep? Sleep Country customers don't have to count sheep. They count the money they save. Serta said the more you buy, the bigger the discounts. Enough mattress sets to make a pile three kilometers high. That means great savings. That's bad. Who is this? <laughs> Your old toilet brush is so full of germs, it's becoming a nightmare. Introducing the new Flushable Brush, the cleaner way to clean from Fantastic. Just click on the pad and clean. The concentrated Fantastic cleaner activates when wet. Then just flush the pad and the mess away. The pad breaks up in water and it's septic tank safe. Say goodbye to germy brushes. Get the new Fantastic Fresh Brush and flush the mess away. SC Johnson, a family company. For money-saving coupons, visit fantastic.ca. Introducing fresh summer selections from KFC. Side salads inspired by summer with fresh summer ingredients like juicy oranges, succulent tomatoes, cool cucumber, and luscious pineapple. KFC's fresh summer selections. As summer as summer love. There's more. There's more in the bucket. She went for the big box. A mojo from the original Joe Millionaire. But these guys only have jump change. Mojo's digging down the wrong hole, because I'm broke. Reality Romeo Week on Eliminate. Tonight at 10. She wears vinyl. She wears this. You can be big, and I, big can be beautiful. I'm not going to deny her that. But big has to be, I don't know, she wears some things that just should be Well, let's be see what she's wearing today, shall we? Why should you just have a small little dream when you can have a big one? Overweight loved ones need to shape up and slim down because bigger is definitely not better. Our next guest, Coco Peru, says she was inspired to become a drag queen by her friend Fantasy Island. But Coco says now fantasy is ruining her own career by becoming lazy and overweight. Miss Coco Peru, come on out. Coco? Yes, go ahead. Hi, Coco. So you are concerned for your friend? I'm concerned for a friend. Her laziness is getting very tired, basically. Tell us. Okay, tell us about her. All right. My, fa my friend Fantasy, she's about 400 plus pounds. She's been doing drag for about three years now. And she's on the plus side. She's gotten very comfortable who she is. And she doesn't like to wear, like, the kind of upbeat kind of clothes, like shoes, basically, what you're what you know, supposed to wear on stage. Anyways, there was this story. We were at a, like a pageant, she was performing at a pageant, she was the guest performer, and she decided to wear like these heels, but they weren't like the stiletto heels that like are really like up top of the fashion kind of girl would wear, 
They're like the chunky heels. And she's walking down the runway as she was dancing. It was like sections of the runway. Uh oh. And as she was walking, they kept going deep, further, deeper, or, you know, sinking she in, sinking in. She was sinking the runway? And as she got to the last one, the heel caught the runway and she had fell. And when she had fell, she like, in slow motion. I don't know why girls fall in slow motion. <laughs> anyway, so that was like the talk of the whole city. And actually, it's a story that's gonna actually keep with her for like, five, it's been for going like for five years now. She's been doing drag for a while. And you're saying she needs to change her look? She needs to change that look. If she was wearing like a stiletto heel, she'd probably be more, you know, cautious on it. But so she needs to change the heel or does she need to lose weight? Both. <laughs> Both. I mean, you gotta be on top of your game. You gotta look, you know, fit, basically. Uh, all right, but you have to know, like, beauty comes in all shapes and sizes, right? If, okay, I agree and with genders. that. I, I agree with that, but however, keep up on your game. I mean, if you're gonna be a big, a plus size girl, how about you hide it, pull it in, pad Suck it up? Suck it up. Come on, do what you need to do Up with and that. out. All right, well, you know what? Let's have a royal welcome for drag queen Fantasy Island. Oh, yeah. Fantasy, oh, you look okay. lovely. Thank you. I have to say, you stand out in a crowd. Well, I should. <laughs> so, what do you have to say in response? Did you, in fact, sink the runway? Well, well, you know what? The runway was kind of, it wasn't as firm, I'm sure, as yours. But you know what? It was, they told us not to go to the edges. But I get so involved. You always in my... take it to the edge, I'll bet. <laughs> but you know what? I get so involved in my numbers that it doesn't even matter. So I was getting involved. I was doing my thing, spinning, twirl. I don't even know what I was doing, but I got too close to the edge of my momentum kind of kept me going <laughs> a little bit. But you know what? I wasn't really getting tipped during that number, and I do this for the money. So you know what? I wasn't really getting tipped during that number, but when I fell after that, honey, I made money off the hook. Really? And you know what? If that's what it took to make money, I'm falling on your show in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. There was this one time. So is your friend here, Coco's just jealous, right? Oh, uh, she needs to get a life. She's just, uh, only a dog wants a bone, honey. You know what? Bigger is better. If you can't hide it, decorate it. Touche. Yes, sir. Let's see. Don't worry about how, because you look over, honey. Oh, thank you, baby. Oh, wow. Wow, Ricky. wow, wow. Ricky. Yes, Ricky. Coco. There was this one time we were in Toronto, and it was three It was three of our girlfriends. We all were deciding to go out. So we stopped at this, you know, this Puerto Rican bar. It was really nice. It wasn't that much busy, but... We had a good time. We were dancing. Well, the next bar we went to was Five, which was like an upkept, kind of, you know, really busy. Music was pumping. We were walking through the audience, and she was bumping in everybody. So she decided to sit down on the bench, and we had to Ricky, go and dance. Ricky, that is not yeah. why I sat down. This thing, don't try it. I sat down because they wanted and to work the trade in the audience, and, and the people walking through the bar wanted to pick up men. But, honey, I didn't have to walk through the audience. They were coming up to me. <laughs> so, that's bad, honey. Yes, hi. Hi, Ricky. All I gotta say is, when I seen the skinny he she, I knew she was a man. But when I seen her, she looked more like a woman. Thank you. Go, you. girl. She looks nice. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. All right. Well, fantasy. I think the only fair way to judge if Miss Coca Peru is right or if she's just a jealous diva is to take a look at your moves for ourselves. Would you please do us the honor of strutting your stuff on the runway? Oh. <laughs> argument we want your vote does fantasy have it going on or is it time for her to hang up her heels if you think she's still a fierce diva clap now <laughs> and if you think it's time for fantasy to give up clap now uh oh well fantasy i think this audience love what you have going out okay. every pound of you don't forget, Stefan is backstage learning some sexy new moves, and Steve is getting a shave and a haircut. We'll catch up with them later, but up next, a woman who says her best friend may have lost the weight, but that is no excuse for her losing her self-respect. Can she convince her to give up the trashy new ways? We'll find out next. <laughs> 
instead of the new sexy me, it's more like the new sleazy me. You've never been fat. You don't know. One night while your boyfriend was on stage, you went outside and actually had an oral sex with another guy? She went and got her nipples pierced. And her cookie pierced. Here she is now, Patty! Closed captioning of this program is brought to you in part by the Volkswagen Jetta. If you really want to know what makes a Volkswagen a Volkswagen, drive it. You'll get it. What's new about Ziploc freezer bags? Tired of throwing away freezer burn food? The new improved Ziploc freezer bag with the extra thick freeze guard seal helps keep freshness in and freezer burn out. The improved Ziploc freezer bag with the freeze guard seal. Redesigned with you in mind. Now inside Ziploc and Saran, you'll find over $10 worth of money-saving coupons on SC Johnson products. From all of us, thank you. SC Johnson, a family company. Looking for an exciting new salad? Try Wendy's new spinach chicken salad with fresh romaine and baby spinach, tender pieces of seasoned chicken breast filet, and a delicious sweet and sour bacon dressing with two and a half grams of fat. Wendy's new spinach chicken salad. It's better here. Give your firming routine a powerful boost. Add Nivea Firming Moisturizing Lotion Q10 Plus. It has natural coenzyme Q10. The lotion improves elasticity and makes skin look firmer while you moisturize, so you'll get even better results. From Nivea. Bingo! Instant Bingo's birthday bonus is back. Bingo! <laughs> Bingo! Want in on the celebration? Bingo! Just say the word. Instant Bingo's birthday bonus. It's back with extra prizing. That means more money and more winners. Hurry to your lottery retailer today. Bingo! Excitement from scratch. It's a cheater's challenge. I'm here today to prove that I wouldn't even cheat. A cheater can cheat, but what will they have to eat? Spin that wheel. Whatever you land on, you're going to eat as much of it as you can. We're going to have a little tongue. Oh, yeah. Next, Ricky. Do you fear for the safety of a loved one who is obsessed with meeting men over the internet? Do you want to stop them from internet dating and having cyber sex? You could be a guest. Call 1-800-GO-RICKY or log on to www.ricky.com. Well, you need to change that because I don't want to see all your roll. You looking like Jelly Roll Belly. She got to do something. Come on out, Peaches. <laughs> debate with men who are being told they need to lose weight and women who lost the weight but are being told they are now acting too wild. Our next guest, Angela, says she is proud of her friend Patty's drastic 160 pound weight loss, but she is not proud of the person Patty has become. Uh, how has the weight loss changed her? It has changed her drastically, Ricky. I can't take it anymore. I don't want to go out with her anymore. She's lost a lot of weight. Now she's dressing provocative. She's wearing hiked up skirts up to here. She's letting her butt hang out. She's letting her breast hang out. And I can't take it anymore, Are Ricky. you concerned that she's getting more attention than you are now? I don't know, Ricky. It's not about jealousy. And that's something that she would say. It has nothing to do with jealousy. It's the way she's presenting herself. But this is a woman who used to weigh over 300 pounds and now is 160 okay, pounds. Okay, okay, okay. Doesn't but she have a right to flaunt it a little bit? Not like she is, no. 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 She's, okay, I'll put it to you like this. This is exactly what I mean. Instead of the new sexy me, it's more like the new sleazy me. And she shouldn't be like that. She doesn't have to dress like that. Describe her look for, for us. She wears what? Short, short, short she, skirts? Okay, this is what I mean by short, okay? This is too short, okay? Dresses and, and shirts come down to here. I'm worried about her, Ricky. She's going out. She's going out by herself. She's getting drunk. For instance, let me tell you this. 
we go to Myrtle Beach, okay? We go to Myrtle Beach for a concert. Crazy things happen at Myrtle Beach. Crazy things happen at Myrtle Beach. I thought we were going to be okay. She had a cute dress on. It was very, very short, but it's long sleeve. This is, nothing's revealing. I thought this was a cute outfit. I thought we were going to have a good time. This was just a couple of months ago. We get to the concert, and sure enough, we're standing by the stairs. There's two bouncers, and what does she do? They make a comment because she looks cute, which is great. That's fine. But she turns around and hikes her dress up like this and shows them her whole butt. Okay. Is she wearing underwear? Thong, if you want to call that underwear. But then the dude next to him, this bouncer number two, says, hey, wait a minute. I missed that. Oh, man. And she goes, oh, honey, you didn't miss nothing. Boom. And does it again. All right. Okay. So you she just wanted to tone it down. Tone it down. Just tone it down. She All right. You do great. give her props for the weight loss. I give her props you... for the like, weight loss, but she's got to tone it All down. All right. Well, you Ricky. know what? Let's meet the woman who is literally half the size she used to be. Come on out, Patty. Let me just say, you used to be over 300 pounds. Look at those legs. You've Thank got you. some gorgeous legs. First thing I got to say is... Look at her I... before picture. Wow. Okay. Can I just go off topic for just a second? How did you lose this weight? Sexercise. Sexercise. <laughs> a lot of water and a lot of cardio. A lot, a lot of, of cardio and yeah. no surgery. No surgery. No. No. Wow. No. Wow. No. That's she did amazing. Good. But the first thing I want to say about the Myrtle Beach thing is who got the free tickets. Oh. Okay. Uh -huh. So. <laughs> All right. Are you are you going crazy? Are you flaunting your body? Are you putting yourself at sure. risk? Yeah. Not at risk, but yes. I mean, being 310 pounds and being able to look what okay, you look now. Okay. 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 You've never been fat. You don't know. No, I haven't. Okay. And maybe I don't know. But Ricky, my point is, okay, before she lost the weight, before she lost the weight, she wouldn't go out with me. She wouldn't keep my kids so that I could go out. She, and it's not even about going dancing or anything. She wouldn't even go to, like, maybe a pool hall and shoot a game of pool. Now, she's lost all the weight. She's out every night. She's drinking every night. She's yeah, wearing let me also add, Angela. No, 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 I'm not yes. drinking. No, whatever. Angela, you say that one night while your boyfriend was on stage, you went outside and actually had oral sex with another guy? Oh, that was me. That yeah, that was, was you. Yeah, that was me. Yeah. That's the kind that of things. That's the kind of things I'm that dealing with, Ricky. Now, tell me I shouldn't be concerned. Okay, tell me I shouldn't be concerned. So I it's learned, really but, not a weight issue. But I learned, it's not. I learned, it's the I way she's the carrying. Best. She's carrying. Oh, <laughs> you did not say that. <laughs> she is carrying herself wrong, Ricky. She's carrying herself wrong. She walks into bingo, okay, and she hadn't even lost all her weight yet. She walks into bingo with shorty shorts on, midriff top, and she went in there to play bingo. She just is like walking in and like, here's me. Here's the new sleazy me. I just left me. the gym and, and I went by to see her. That's I didn't besides go in the flock. point, Patty. Well, you know That's what? There's no the question. You, you, you look on. terrific, but you know your friend Angela would love to see you in something slightly less skimpy. So we're yes. gonna send you backstage and do a little make under for you. All right. All right. Put a little more clothes on you. Make you look great. Make you feel a great lot too. More clothes, Ricky. Uh, a, a lot, lot more, clothes? more clothes. All right. Well, we'll compromise. We'll compromise. <laughs> but we'll see you at the end of the hour. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you. <laughs> there she goes. Up next, a woman who says. That when her cousin went from a size 24 to a size 12, she must have lost her mind along with the weight because now she is a sex crazed freak. Can she convince her to calm down? We'll find out after this. Introducing Kellogg's Raisin Bran Crunch. Crunchy whole wheat flakes. A taste of honey in oat and granola clusters. All together with two scoops of plump, juicy raisins. New Raisin Bran Crunch cereal. The cereal with loads of stuff and loads of crunch. What's new about Ziploc freezer bags? Tired of throwing away freezer burn food? The new improved Ziploc freezer bag with the extra thick freeze guard seal helps keep freshness in and freezer burn out. The improved Ziploc freezer bag with the freeze guard seal. Redesigned with you in mind. Now inside Ziploc and Saran, you'll find over $10 worth of money-saving coupons on SC Johnson products. From all of us, thank you. 
SC Johnson, a family company. tastier with Newman's own dressings. McDonald's introduces three delicious salads from our new Salads Plus menu. McDonald's. Do you fear for the safety of a loved one who is obsessed with meeting men over the internet? If you want to stop them from internet dating and having cyber sex, you could be a guest. Call 1-800-GO-RICKY or log on to www.ricky.com. show say they are finally proud of their bodies because they've lost a lot of weight but their loved ones say that when they lost the weight they gained a bad attitude especially when it comes to sex our next guest Sasheen says her cousin Madeline dropped 12 dress sizes and her baby's father to become the lean woman she is today so Sasheen what's the problem Ricky my cousin lost all this weight and now she's got friends um, she went and got her nipples pierced <laughs> And her cookie, Pierce. And her what? And her cookie. Her cookie. Her cookie. And her tongue ring. So, you see the shirt? Yeah. I'm glad you're on daytime television because if you weren't, you'd be seeing her girls with the nipples, everything just showing. She doesn't cover it up. You see this nice, cute little shirt right here? Yeah. You can see through it. Yeah. It's cute, but she would wear this with a sheer bra with the big girls and the nipple rings just showing out. She took a trip. And you say she wasn't like this before. She stayed in the house, Ricky. I would want to go out. We would go out to eat. We would eat food. I would get drunk and at the you're saying you miss that Madeline? You miss the Madeline <laughs> that wouldn't go outside? Well, I wish that she would carry herself in a better way. She's not presenting herself as a classy lady like she should be, you know? And she's having sex with strangers? She went to Chicago, hooked up with some guy in Chicago, took him to the room. He's performing oral sex on her. It's no big deal. She knows, doesn't know him. She doesn't know anything about this man. She goes to the bars by herself. Which so is, you're concerned for her safety? Yes, it's and not And you are safe. embarrassed? It's embarrassing because these men talk about her. All right, well, you know what? Let's meet your cousin. Madeline, come on out. I'm over oh, here, I'm over here. Hi. So you went from a size 24 to a 12. Yes. Wow, how'd you do it? Exercise, a lot of it. I Not sex exercise. No, 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 exercise. It just has to be healthy for me. She's jealous. I am not jealous, jealous, jealous in any way. Okay, she's telling I'm a story about Chicago. She can't tell a story if she's not there. I'll tell you what happened in Chicago. I went to Chicago with a group of friends for work. There's quite a few of us. One of my friends already had relatives in Chicago. The relative was like, That's hey, a, already she, a hookup. Hold on, hold on. It's she, he was like, she her. wanted to, he wanted to meet you. I said, fine. They must have talked and they told him that I had my cookie as she called it pierced. But again, she wasn't there. He came in the room and he said, hey, I have something, you know, I heard you have something I need to see. I was like, what are you talking stranger? about? Total stranger, total stranger. Total stranger. He was like, I heard you have something I need to see. And I'm like, what are you talking about? He said, well, you know, your girl told me you got your stuff pierced. I was like, yeah, can I see it? Again, if a woman did that to a man, she'd be a hoe. He a hoe. I don't want to associate myself with him again. He did what he did. That's his One business. One time was good enough for One you. One time was good enough. All right, but wait. This is quite a different Madeline from the time for seven years you stayed home with I your kids. I stayed home. I take care of my kids. I have a job. 
When I'm big and I can go out with her, it's good so she can drink. But now that I want to go out by myself, she wants to don't go let by her herself. get it twisted. I went out with her the past three times we went out. Two of the she times I'm she left me there, with her. took my car and left me at the club. So if you're going to leave anyway, I can go by myself. It's not I'm a grown about me. Woman. It's about her going out. These woman. men are talking about her. She's going to their house She's 11, jealous. 30, 12 o'clock at night. I told not her getting night anything out of the situation no more. at all. Share. Share. Right, you know what? Come on, you, you you might need a new look. You know, can you can we compromise here and give you some? I don't you know, some, some additional fabric person. You know for what? You? I, 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 I'm I can glad that these I are have covered business up suits right now. I, do go to, I, I go to work. I have business suits. When I go out, I'm gonna do what I do when I go out. As long as I'm not going home with strange men, it don't matter. All right, well you know what? Sashina's hoping you will take another drastic step today toward a little tamer look. So we are going to be sending you backstage for a quickie make under, and we'll check in with you in a little while. All right? That's fine. See you soon, honey. Well, well, well. It is time to see the drastic changes we've made to our guests. Will their mates and loved ones finally be satisfied? Find out when Stefan struts his new stripper moves and Steve, Patty, and Madeline reveal their new looks. It's all coming up next. Cheater's Challenge. I'm here today to prove that I wouldn't even cheat. A cheater can cheat, but what will they have to eat? We're going to have a little tongue. Next, Ricky. Closed captioning of this program is brought to you in part by Barnes & Castle. Now you're really cooking. Hey, listen, I was going to go online and see if I could get seats for tonight's concert. Great. Cool. Great seats, 12th row. Buying stuff online just got faster. So now you can do more of what you want with Rogers High Speed Internet. Let's boogie! Sorry, I have a boyfriend. Eh, yeah, what does he do? He's a surgeon. Just a surgeon? That's it? He don't do nothing else? I got two jobs. I'm the hardest working candy in town. I'm a tropical fruit candy. And I deliver the cool, soothing taste sensation. <laughs> Two jobs. Hall's Fruit Breezers. Cool, soothing taste. Great fruit flavor. Both in one cool candy throat drop. Just a pilot. Being the reactive man, helping people relieve their allergy symptoms. Ah, Mike Chan. Was a time he couldn't go near his dusty, moldy garage. Not now. More and more Canadians are happy they chose React and call 187-REACTIN for a trial offer. Relief can really feel good. Rhythm and weep. Now get your gear off, loser. Uh, uh Red, I, I don't want to show my, you know, peanut in public. M&Ms. Mm. Oh. They're a handful of chocolate candy. ones about their weight and have asked us to do whatever we could to improve their appearances and behavior. So now it's time to reveal the changes. I'm so excited. First up is Marianne. She wanted her man Steve to clean up his sloppy overweight act or she was leaving. Let's see what he looked like before. And here he is now. Steve, come on down. difference. Mary Ann, come on. Come Somebody's on. Somebody's going to get lucky tonight. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's not all you're getting, Steve. Now to help you along the rest of the way with your makeover, we have enrolled you in a local gym. We have for you a new one-year membership to Sport Time of the Hamptons. Good for you. Enjoy. 
All right, next up is Patty, who was proud of her incredible weight loss, but her friend Angela thought she was showing it off a little inappropriately. Here is what Patty looked like before. Oh, oh. yes, and here she is now, Patty. You like it? Better. I like it. Yes. It looks great. What do you think, Angela? She looks great. I'll go out with her like this. I would love to go out with her like this. All right, fair <laughs> enough. And who could forget our princess of piercing, Madeline? Her cousin Sasheen wanted Madeline to tone down the sleazy look. Here's Madeline before. And here she is now. Sheen, what do you think? You got a big smile on your face. She looks good. She looks classy and classy. So sexy. I like the shoes with the top. Very nice. Yes. Very nice. And last, but certainly not least, is our stripper wannabe Stefan. Yes, his girlfriend Jamie wanted him to take off some pounds before he took his clothes off, but Stefan also needed some help with his dance moves. So we sent him backstage with our expert, Charles, for a quick dance lesson. Let's see what he has learned. Stefan. time once again if you think Stefan has what it takes to take it all off clap now <laughs> all right how many of you think his career is over yes. oh man <laughs> Charles Charles you did all you could the audience has spoken and they say Stefan should give it up I'm sorry I'm sorry <laughs> Stefan nice try right. need to take a break we'll be right back after this <laughs> Closed captioning is brought to you by Miracle Grow Garden Soil. Premium organic materials plus Miracle Grow plant food mixed in. Look at the difference it makes. Amazing. Introducing the MDG Horizon computer system for only $8.99 or just $0.81 cents a day. That's right, only $8.99 or just $0.81 cents a day gets you a complete MDG Horizon computer system with everything you need. An Intel 2.4 gigahertz processor with 256 meg of DDR RAM, a Samsung 17-inch perfectly flat monitor, an 80 gigabyte hard drive, a CD writer rewriter, four USB 2.0 ports and high-speed Ethernet, a Microsoft keyboard and optical mouse, a base subwoofer with stereo speakers, Windows XP Home and a Microsoft software bundle. Unlike other companies, MDG stands alone and approves almost everyone who calls right now. Plus, you never need a down payment when you buy from MDG. You have nothing to lose. Your MDG Horizon computer system comes with a three-year warranty. If you call now, you'll also receive two months of Rogers high-speed internet service free. A Lexmark printer free. Plus an SMC wireless router free. So don't delay. Call today and get your very own MDG Horizon computer system with no money down for just 81 cents a day. And remember, MDG approves almost everybody who calls today. Call now. Need mosquito protection that works? You're going to love new off mosquito lamp. The candle creates a pleasant glow, while the heat activated pad kills mosquitoes. It's a unique way to effectively protect your patio from mosquitoes. New off mosquito lamp keeps bugs off. Essie Johnson, a family company. 
Feel at home with nature in Autumn Grove, Richmond Hill's ultimate ravine community. Here, you'll be living in the midst of protected valley lands and a vast nature system with spectacular nature trails. Four sensational designer decorated model homes are now open. Detached homes on 45 and 50 foot lots and townhomes range from 1,540 to 3,400 square feet and are brought to you by Rosehaven and Townwood Homes. Visit the Autumn Grove Presentation Center on the west side of Young Street just north of 19th Avenue. Do you fear for the safety of a loved one who is obsessed with meeting men over the internet? If you want to stop them from internet dating and having cyber sex, you could be a guest. Call 1-800-GO-RICKY or log on to www.ricky.com. I want to thank all of our guests for being here today, sharing their stories. It is not always easy to look in the mirror and see what's really there, but whether you're overweight or not, your own self-respect and the respect of your loved ones is more important than numbers on the scale. So whether you're just trying to lose a few pounds or trying to fulfill a lifelong dream of becoming a performer, remember to keep your dignity as you work towards your goal. Or we'll see you here for a reality check. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Promotional fees have been paid by the following. Are your carpets dirty? Well, then it's time to rent the Rug Doctor. The powerful, easy-to-use Rug Doctor gives you professional quality results at a fraction of the cost. Rent one today. Inventors, Invention Submission Corporation can help you try to patent your idea and submit it to companies. Call 1-888-546-IDEA for free information. At 1-800-DENTIST, everything we do is designed to help you pinpoint the best dentist for you. Call us at 1-800-DENTIST today. Really want white? Rembrandt Plus, the toothpaste that works below the surface of your teeth to whiten five full shades. You only need a toothbrush and Rembrandt Plus. For tickets to the Ricky Lake Show, call 1-866-AUDIENCE or log on to www.ricky.com or write to us at Ricky Lake Show Tickets, 226 West 26th Street, 4th Floor, New York, New York, 10001.